But um, that's when you get older, you know, you do things like that, you travel, you get married, you're 21, that's a great age, that's a, that's a fun age, I think I was happy when I was, I was 21. <laughs> well, no, I'm happy now, but you don't have to work at it when you're 21, you know what I mean? Like, for you, this is, like, for example, say, we're here at the Laugh Garage Comedy Club tonight, right? This is, for you, this is just where you're at tonight, alright? For me, this is where I ended up, alright? This is it for me. So let's be clear about where the distinction is, all right? When I was 21, I didn't even know places like this existed, lady, all right? And now I'm here every fucking weekend in places like this, just going, what happened? Like, what happened to my life? Like, I had big plans, all right? They certainly didn't include this exchange right here, all right? I should be, yeah, whatever. I should be doing this. All right, but I'm not old. I'm in my 30s. I, I tell you, I'm too old to get turned into a vampire. I realise that from watching vampire movies. You know when you watch vampire movies? You've got to be your age to get turned into a vampire, right? Because every vampire in every movie is always, even if they're like 900, they're still sexy because they're 21 when they get bitten. You don't want to be my age and get bitten and turned into a fucking bald 30-something vampire. I'm like, well, this is not good for now, let alone eternity, all right? This isn't coming into vogue anytime soon, all right? I don't think it would work for me as a, as a vampire. And there's other rules with being a vampire when you see them in movies. and they're, 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 like, they're always rich, the vampires in movies when you see them. And you notice that they're always living really well financially. They're always living in like castles and it's great for them. And you know, they're mixing with high society and frilly shirts and dames and ladies and all this shit. And I just know that if I was a vampire, I'd be the only vampire who's still like renting, you know, and just running a series of failed businesses into the ground over 900 years. It's kind of, kind of you know, there's no guarantee just because you're 900, you'll figure it out, you know. I just, no, I just kind of fucking just avoiding people till they die of natural causes, just awful. awful. But yeah, you don't want to be this age and, uh, and get turned into a, a vampire. That's it, if you're, if you're your age, how old are you about the same age? You guys are all 20, let's see. You can, if you are 900 years old, but you look 21, you know, you can dance in a nightclub and you can get away with it. That could be your little secret. All right, you can mix and blend in, you know. But if you're my age and dancing in a nightclub, you may as well be 900, all right? <laughs> Because even if I was 900 and passing myself, people would still be looking at me, look at that fucking 36-year-old bald guy, what the fuck is he doing here? And I'd go, oh, 36, thank you so much, if only, if only you knew the truth, you know. But I'm still going home alone, alright, so that's what people do. That's why Twilight is so creepy, you know, the Twilight vampire thing, the big phenomenon of a few years ago. Because, uh, you know, the, the, it was a very romantic story, the Twilight story, and there's a, the vampire is Edward, right? The main vampire, you know the story, he's like a, he's a guy, he's a vampire, and he looks like 20, 19, okay, but he's a vampire, so he's like 900, presumably. So what does he do? He enrolls in the local high school <laughs> and starts dating a student. Is that the creepiest story you ever heard in your life? Teenage girls are swooning over that. This is, I mean, he's got vampire friends in those films as well, and surely they would say to him, look, you've got to stop enrolling in high schools, man. Like, that, don't do that. That's really creepy, man. Like, come on, act your age. You're 900 now. Come on. Can you imagine if the school board found out about that? Hey, but it's come to our attention that you're 900. Like, we'd go within 500 meters of that school. But, uh, that's vampires for you, you know? That's, that, if, if you get the chance, do it now, all right? Do it while you're young, all right? That's, that's the lesson I've got for you. That's my only. Uh, that's the point of the show. <laughs> Smoking is cool, and uh, if you're going to get turned into a vampire, do it while you're young. <laughs> all right. That's all I got.